So this has only got one bar of battery, so hopefully the audio does not cut out. But anyway, g'day mates, it's me, Adrian G, and I thought I would just switch the camera on roller and just take action and film this video because I just finished the book now by Dr. Max McCone and I would highly recommend you read this book because, you know, I would give it a five out of five. And the reason I say this is because reading this book myself has helped me take action in the present moment and launch my company teethwhiteningsolutions.com. So I'll quickly talk about the company real quick. We offer one product and that is activated charcoal. And this is a 100% organic product and you use it to brush your teeth with it and it naturally whitens your teeth while at the same time preventing cavities, bad breath and gum disease. So this here is a three month supply, costs about 45 US dollars and it comes with free worldwide shipping and a free toothbrush. So if you want to naturally whiten your teeth, make sure you pick up one of the products today and you will be automatically, well not automatically, you've got to use the discount code MACBOOK and you'll be entered into the draw for the 15 inch MacBook Pro giveaway that I'll be doing in about two weeks. But anyway, enough about that. The link's in the top of the description if you want to pick up a product. So we're going to get straight into this book. Uh, Max talks a lot about, you know, qualities of a dentist mindset and a nowist mindset. So we're going to talk about that real quick and then see which mindset you sort of lean towards. Do you lean towards a dentist mindset or, you know, a nowist mindset? So when you feel like a dentist, tasks are a means to an end. You do things to look good or to get the task finished. You may forget to enjoy life. Nowist love moving and they seek joy in doing things they don't want to wait like they don't want to waste their lives waiting for happiness so they seek happiness now dentists are more likely to agonize about decisions this can slow them down they can procrastinate or they can suddenly lurch into a decision that makes no sense they can get stuck in a downward spiral nowists make effortless rapid or fast decisions. They see sequences and they have a sense of where they're going. When in a dentist mindset, you can be easy to interrupt or slow down. Even distant worries can derail you and leave you in a downward spiral of inactivity and anticipated regret. You can work hard, but it feels like hard work, leaving you worn out and overwhelmed. But when you're in a nowist mindset with almost limitless energy to keep moving forward, you see obstacles as opportunities and stress as just another source of forward motion. Dentists tend to be self-doubting. They may second guess their own judgment even when they know they're factually correct. Nowists tend to be self-trusting. They're confident in their abilities in general and in particular, their abilities to improve and learn. They develop a sense of personal power, not over others, but to make good things happen. They test their ability and learn more about cause, effect. They also learn more about the meaning and value of their actions and outcomes. When in a dentist mindset, your energy can be wasted on worry, on going nowhere except self-defeating or passive directions. The worry can steal from your positive present. When in a nowist, um, a nowist are more of a doer energy. So they invest their time or energy in things they can change. And when they recognize like the worry, they simply just roll out of negativity and move forwards. They enjoy the, you know, the power of now. They enjoy the power of now. So a quick recap of that. So the five qualities of a dentist. So one, tasks as means. Two, slow decisions. Three, easy to interrupt. Four, self-doubting. Five, uh, what if worry. And then the five qualities of a nowist 
One, uh, love moving. Two, fast decisions. Three, uh, make things happen. Four, um, self-trusting. And then five, a doer energy. So with all that being said, uh, which do you think you lean more towards? Uh, Dennist mindset or nowist mindset? And if you're, if you're over here and you want to get over here, what are you going to do to get there? Like, are you going to act on your goals today? What are you going to do? Are you going to take action today? Or are you going to just keep talking shit to your friends being like, oh yeah, these are my future plans. But they're never going to happen because you don't act upon them today. It's like, you know, if you've got to take action now, for example, I would be, I remember in the past, I would tell my mates all my goals and they were just unrealistic. You know how you've got a goal and this is a goal, right? And you divide it into small tasks. And once you complete all these small tasks, eventually you achieve that goal. But because the goal is so unrealistic, I never acted upon it. I was always like, oh yeah, I'm going to do this in the future. Instead of making the goal more realistic, um, you know, divide it into small tasks and take action upon those tasks right now in the present moment, because that's where things happen. That's the only place things are going to happen. Uh, they're going to happen in the present moment. They're not going to happen in the future. I know that makes a, doesn't really make a bit of sense, but you know, they are going to happen now. So, um, yeah, I think, I think that's about it. I just wanted to you know, put that in your mind right now. And hopefully this sort of motivates you to take some action, whether it's, you know, to, to launch a business, whether maybe launch a YouTube channel, maybe read a book or something, just freaking do it. Just take action right now. And I think I'm going to leave it at that. I really do appreciate you guys, um, you know, for watching. So if you did learn something from this video, if, if you enjoyed it, hit the thumbs up. If you didn't hit the dislike button, I really don't give a fuck. Like, honestly, I don't give a fuck. Like, I I meet some of you guys in public and you guys are just freaking amazing. So friendly and humble. I feel as though you guys are as mates. I feel like we're mates. You know what I mean? When I meet you guys in public, I feel like we're we're mates. So I know there's always going to be trolls out there disliking, but, you know, I don't really give a fuck, you know, as long as I know the real people are watching, you know, the real mates are there. Um, that's all that matters. So I appreciate your support when you hit the thumbs up. I appreciate the support. So, yeah, that's once again, I do recommend this book. The, the link is in the top of the description. We're going to put this book in right here with the other books I reviewed. Uh, next book we will be talking about is, I'm going to read this, it's called 59 Seconds by Richard Wiseman. So I'm going to read that and I'm going to sort of do a little review on that next week. So that's about it. Remember, if you want to support my company, get a pack. It will last you three months. You'll have wider teeth naturally. Um, it can also replace a commercial toothpaste. I usually use commercial toothpaste in the morning and then I use this at night. So I have a bit of a mix. So this would last me about six months because I use half, half. Um, but yeah, with that, with that being said, I, I don't know what kind of financial situation you guys are in. So I don't want you to be spending, you know, say for instance, your rent money, taking out rent money and then you're worrying. But if you can um, support the company, I'd appreciate it. Get a pack and use the discount code MacBook you will be entered in the draw to win this uh, this MacBook. Whoa, I nearly dropped it. This MacBook right here. It is brand new. As you can see, I'm excited to give this away. You can see all the behind the scenes on this vlog channel. I will be seeing you guys for a vlog tomorrow. I love you guys and I'll see you all tomorrow.